Hey, it's uh, me, Albert, with Two Tribes Primal Living. And Nikki. And uh, you yeah, probably haven't seen us in a little while. We've been kind of in a hiatus, just enjoying being out here, enjoying the mountains, enjoying um, the solitude and the uh, peace and tranquility. But most of all, what have we been enjoying out here that out here provides I say healing and connectivity. It's it's energy. It's it's positive um, nourishment and um, regeneration. Yeah, the energy out here is uh, is just something that uh, it's clean. That yeah, it's, clean. It, it's it's like the water. It's like the air. It's it's clean. There's there's no noise. There's uh, no. I mean. You have zero distractions unless you have something like we just had happened a couple of seconds ago the chickens were screaming and there was a hawk um, above their cage and they uh, it was like oh shit I gotta run down there and find out what's going on yeah they just started screaming and he ran I was like hoof it bro and he took off and ran and and came back on the bike and he's like yeah there was a hawk and they were all in the coop <laughs> yeah but that's the energy that we experience out here uh, I know back home the energies that we experienced were a lot different than than we experience out here. Um, and what are we talking about? Energy. Uh, people th uh, usually associate their mood, their temperament, their personality, their their ego, their um, what, what their identity. I call it as a spiritual person. I call it a person's aura or their vibe. It's that. It's that big bubble that comes in the room with the person before they even open their mouth. Yeah, That's and a lot of people, that big bubble is shit. Um, I mean, they walk into a room and they can literally just destroy the vibe of a room yeah. with their either negativity, but on the other hand, you got, drama. you got some people whose energy just raises the vibration of that room and uh, you, you, can, you can sense it or... You know, a lot of times it's you walking into the room or me walking into the room and it's like, oh shit, what did I just walk into? Um, you can, And you can feel, think about going, think about two people being in a room together and you come upon them and all of a sudden their conversation gets quiet. You sense that they were conversing. They are probably talking shit about, about you. About you. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. People don't just, and I've had it, I've had Albert off talking to somebody else and I walk in the room and they get quiet and I'm like, what? And I never find out what they're talking about. So I'm sure it had something that was either not okay or maybe about me. He's had it happen to him. It was I think a we all have, it was a surprise. Yeah, I, we're planning I'm, I'm a waiting, surprise. Right. Yeah. No. So I think we all experience that, but that's energy. Yeah. Yes. Well, I mean, yeah, but the energy out here in the mountains, uh, away from everybody, uh, I'm going to use this as an example back from when, when, uh, I was, uh, back home, uh, people just dump their energy on you. Um, okay. it could be something as simple as you work in your job. Um, and, uh, you're having a great day. You had a great morning. Uh, everything's going great. And then somebody walks into your place of work or your business or wherever you are uh, at a grocery store and they just dump all their shit on you because they're having a shitty day and their energy is 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 low vibrating and the way we we define energy the way we uh, relate to energy is either a high vibrating energy or a low vibrating energy and a lot of the low vibrate low vibrations of this earth are what you experience with the mainstream, with with TV, with with sports, with with uh, holidays, and and all the religion and politics, and and uh, all the uh, all the yeah all the cultural shit that is going on right now, uh, that's a uh, that's the low vibrating energy. When you have people who are who are high vibrating, they're above all that stuff. They they don't get involved with the politics. They don't get involved with the with the the cultural wars and 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 the cultural social. Uh, I want to fit in. And I need to have a new car, so I'm going to go get into debt so that these people that I don't even fucking like um, will think that I'm a I'm a successful person. 
and those are the lower vibrating parts of, 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 of this existence that most people dwell in. They thrive in, and that's called success, or that's called acceptance. But those are all like energies. There's something higher up here that doesn't relate to those things, and you know, we have hard times talking to people uh, because we can't really speak truth all the time because our energy doesn't mesh with theirs. When we start talking about truthful, spiritual, ancients, uh, our ancestors, the, 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 uh, the, the more spiritual ways of looking at this planet and, and being involved in this existence, most people just shut off to it and they don't want to hear it. They want to talk about football or they want to talk about dancing with the stars. It, or makes, they... you, it makes them uncomfortable. It's not that they don't want to talk about it. I think it makes energy and higher vibrating conversations are very difficult to have with people who have always known or always operated at this low level. When you're at the low level, you don't know you're at the low level. You don't. You have no, no idea. You, you thrive there. You thrive there. You and you live there. Once you ascend, and I'll call it ascension. There are steps to ascension. But once you start operating on higher, higher vibrating frequencies, you can never go back to the low. You you yeah. can't. There's no way. So these guys at the low, they can't talk to us. It's like speaking two completely different languages. It is. We can understand where they are because we've been there, but we cannot go back. They cannot understand where we are because they've not ever been there. So that's kind of the, that difference in language. Yeah, because they believe in stuff. People on, on, on lower vibrating frequencies have a tendency to believe. They believe. And, and it's not Believe that they systems. It, yes. it's not that they believe because they've come to these conclusions it's that they believe because they've been told these perspectives and they've been told that this is the way it is and let's call it domesticated yeah it well it's indoctrination indoctrination from they're the in, time of birth yeah it's it, it, they they've ever since they they came out of the womb they've been they've had others energies interjected into them in the expectations of of what success is and what freedom is and what what uh, uh, charity is and what uh, uh, what uh, acceptance is and and all these 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 uh, expectations put on from parents and uncles and cousins and aunts and uncles and teachers and employers and all the uh, pastors and and politicians and everybody who has a hand in molding the ego that that uh they're touching they, yeah. they touch you with their words and their expectations and and their what they what they think you should be doing and what happens with what happens when somebody influences your existence they like she said they leave their fingerprints on you their energy their energies whether they're good intentions or bad intentions that energy stays with you and, and it's very difficult to shake because you don't even know that it occurred most people don't even know why they're in the job that they're in or why they're in the marriage that they're in or why they're not in the marriage that they, they deserve to be in or why they're not in the occupation that they deserve to be in because people have dumped their either positive or negative energy. And a lot of people, you know, most people like me, um, I have a, I have a, a, a plethora of, of energies that have been uh, dumped onto me and it's like what were we talking about earlier so um, the egg the egg so uh, I, this is a great story that we have hens out here right there there are hens out here on the property that we tend to so we get up and we check their their boxes and there's this egg nobody has touched that egg except that hen and then Albert grabs that egg and brings it to me and if albert's day has been fabulous if he's had a great day he's had no roller coasters then he's going to transfer whatever energy that positive energy onto that egg and then he's going to hand that egg to me and i've had a fabulous day and it's just like oh look at the egg and it this egg is clean but you go to a grocery store or even a farmer's market and that egg has been 
taken out of the hen box by somebody and maybe that person who took it out was fighting with their spouse so they touched that egg and then that egg got washed by the other partner who was still pissed off and then that egg got put in a carton and that carton got handled by some other lady who was just like a little bit out there and then it goes to the farmers market all these people look at these eggs and touch them and then someone takes them home you've transferred all those energies onto that egg and that when you crack that yeah egg, and that's something people don't understand don't that it. everything everything that surrounds you um, I've energy. talked about it. I've talked about it in other videos. Everything that sur surrounds you, including yourself, the soul that that, that uh, is within this host body, is energy. It yes. is all energy, um, and there's 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 no way to escape energy um, in the cities. And that's one of the things that I was going to talk about out here in the cities. The the energy is just so vast. If you've ever been to I Vegas, mean, that those those energies <laughs> there, it it is so. I mean, I go in a grocery store, and I'm I'm one of these people that people take a little bit of me every 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 with every interaction, and by the time I walk out of a grocery store, I'm I'm completely drained. I have nothing left because I've been depleted by all the low vibrating energy that that is involved in going to a grocery store from people. Um, in their mask and people in there uh, going down the wrong way any even before all this stuff yeah you know just the 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 rudeness and the expectations and the the uh the 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 the, the colors and the the advertisements and all the energy People's of all the products of the of the crappy products the yeah. crappy food the crappy uh, uh, yeah. uh, lighting the, 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 it's all there. It's, 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 it's all it's energy there. All in, there. It's so like it drains web. me. It completely drains me. And not everyone is as sensitive like you. No, not every. And so it's not a bad thing to be sensitive like that to energy. But if you go into the grocery store and you're energized when you come out, you're probably very low vibrating is what I'm going to say, because those are the lowest vibration. Unless you see vibrational someone in there that you've been happy to see and you hadn't seen them in a while. Yeah, no. well, some people, they just live to go to the grocery store or go shopping or, no. or standing in the lines at Starbucks or at the fast food places. Uh, you know, I don't eat fast food because it's bad for me. I don't eat fat, fast food because the interactions yeah. and, and dealing with a fast food place is so low vibrating that I, I, I just can't do it. There's no way from the food to the to the employees to the, the marketing to everything that's involved. The, the whole of, process. Of the whole process yeah. is just this, 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 this shit that they serve you with the shitty service and then they charge you for it and it's just like... Man, I just got raped of all my energy and all my my nutrients and my money. So all for this, all for yeah, convenience. Just so yeah. that I don't have to cook something at home. And it, and and but people trade that off. Yeah. And they don't even realize they're doing it. Yeah. You know, you turn on the TV, um, and and this is the whole this is the whole nutshell that when 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 I look at energy, I remember being a kid, and. Uh, Hearing the Christians talk about if you listen to heavy metal music, uh, that's the devil's music. And if you play it backwards, it's got uh, subliminal Back messages masking, and the devil's yeah. trying. Okay. Now that I'm an adult and I'm, I'm a little bit more spiritually awakened, I can, I can probably say that what they were trying to explain, and this is what churches and, and, and religion fails to do. They tell you that it's the devil. They tell you that this is Jesus's music, but this is the devil's music, and you should listen to Jesus's music and not the devil's music. But it all comes down to energy, because when you listen, when you listen to the mainstream music, and you watch mainstream TV, Dancing with the Stars, and and uh, what are all the the, the reality shows that I they have know. out there? Um, you turn on MTV, Alone, and you have yeah, uh, the Bachelorette, called. and and all the talk shows and all the news media and all the music that is put out by by these super mega stars that, that I mean and, and there's not one person that that I can I can say that I 100% go man that person is 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 authentic that person is clear clean because all these people who are in these high ranking uh, uh, statuses of stardom and in, in, in celebrity celebritardism and uh, they've reached these levels of what do you call it? Success, success, 
where people admire them and they want to be like them, like Oprah and, and Katy Perry and, and, and uh, who, are, who, who are all these politicians who are, these people have sold their souls. They have sold out to somebody and they've had to give part of their existence, their, the energy existence of them and whatever money whatever i don't care what it is whether it's nike mercedes benz harley davidson um coach purses i don't give a shit what it is these people all exploit somebody and they've exploited somebody so anytime you buy one of these products um all the energy all that negative energy that was involved in these people selling their souls and selling their authenticity and selling their 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 truth for the dollar you partake in all that energy and all that energy is transferred to you and it's transferred through the music through the entertainment through the food what else is there everything, everything that the, the the consumerism you know in, in America the, the the energy of America and you can look at any any economic economic um, uh, article you're not you're not referred to as citizens you're not a citizen you're not a patriot you're a consumer and that's the energy that has been placed on to us as as as, as Americans as human beings as consumers we're no longer valuable our energy has been robbed from us our truth our higher vibrating energies have been traded out for sold out entertainment sold out uh, uh athletes sold out uh politicians sold out media personnel and y'all just eat it up people just eat it up and they don't even realize that the the religions that they follow have also sold out too and they're just taking and taking and taking and taking your energy so that you feel like you need to make yourself feel better by buying something or giving of your time or giving of your money and it's it, it's all by design your energy is the energy that your soul came into this existence with is not what it was not what it was when you first started off your innocence has been taken your your truth has been taken your integrity has been taken your honesty has been taken your honor has been taken and what are they going to take, take next your freedom all based on energy i'm going to let you talk about it a little bit because <laughs> I go on about this, this, this energy that 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 they rob us of, that the 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 marketing, the politicians, the religions, the corporations, all these people take from us, and and what are we left with? How do we? How do? How does this stuff get fixed? Well, it, it gets fixed from the inside. I think in a theme in every single video we've done collaboratively, where there's not a whole lot of of emotion in the video we've talked about going inside um, and energy we have to shield ourselves we have to ground ourselves and be confident in ourselves and not let we, we have to understand where we are on that that vibration you know we had a discussion yesterday we were talking about love um, and you know, Albert said something that was really funny. It was it would it, it, it what it's truth, but it was funny. It was like, I love everybody. <laughs> I do. I love everybody. But there's a wave. Think of the the sine wave or whatever it's called. Um, you know, frequency wave. Frequency wave. wave. Um, the top is the high. The bottom is the low. The low is hate. The top is love. Is bliss. So. It's normal to operate here, but it's all part of the love-hate cycle. So you can't love unless you hate. Um, and that doesn't mean hate as in I'm gonna go kick that kid in the shins because he stepped in my flowers. I mean, it, that's, that's like aggressive, angry hate. But you, how do we fix it? You have to understand that this is all the same and it's all energy it's all frequency it's all vibration so when you when you hear the, the term or you hear somebody one of these flower people say 
hi, I love everybody, and everything is love, and let's just love, 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 make Rainbows love, not war. Rainbows, and you know, I, what, that's I what should they're, glitter. So, yeah, so what they're talking about, and I, I didn't mean to interrupt that, so I keep that thought. Glitter. Keep that thought, not <laughs> shit and glitter. But, but love is what connects us all together yes. as human beings. And, and, and as she explained, it's a... It's, it's different ranges of love. It's, yes. it's, it's, it's at the top, you got the higher vibration energy of, man, everything's great. I love these people. Everything is fantastic. And then you got the people at work that you're kind of like, eh, I can deal with them. And then you got the people who are on the opposite side of your political party or on a, uh, uh, who want to kill babies at, at nine, nine months or, or, or who aren't your religion. That's the lower vibration of love, but that's something that everybody on this planet experiences at some point. And it's what keeps us all together. It's what keeps the trees. It's what keeps the, the birds and animals and, 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 and mountains and clouds and everything. It's that energy of love, and it's there somewhere. You're in that range of, some, uh, of love somewhere with everybody you interact. Everybody's energy that has ever been part of your world. Either you kind of love them or you kind of hate them or you kind of just wish they would go away. That's that connectivity. That's that part that says we are one. So go back to what you were saying. So what I was saying is we have the, the love and hate cycle and the energy. That is energy. That is energy. We've labeled it as love-hate cycle, but it is energy. So the energy comes up through the ground, through the body, in through here, out through the hands. You receive energy. Um, the people shooting the guns in the background. That's yeah. energy. That's sending frequencies out into us. They love shooting guns. They love shooting guns. <laughs> <laughs> but how do you fix it? You have to identify that that is energy. You have to be in control of your energy. That means you can't be out there trying to tell somebody else how to live their life and how to have... You have to... You have to have your shit together. Yeah, you have to find a new a, a place of neutrality. Of neutrality. I had someone say the other day, you know, neutral's great, but no, neutral is. I can't be divided. I can't because if I am divided, then I'm a belief system person. And if I'm a belief system person, then I'm down here. Yeah, and you can be manipulated just like that. Just exactly. by one news article can change can your change whole you. fucking day. One news article, one person's actions, one word. I go into the grocery store. I don't respond the same way. We used to laugh. Um, my son and I, we would go and it was like, well, we didn't have any problems. We go with Albert <laughs> and it's like everything is jacked up. It's like, what the hell? Poor Albert. He has that 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 sense around him. I know some old lady's gonna pull out her checkbook. And, and guess her what they do? They, right before. they pull out <laughs> when I go without him, it is like, hey, smooth sailing, no problem. Front row parking. Front row spot. parking, no drama. Yeah, and me. I'm like, I can't even go back and tell him that. Yeah. So me. that's that's his energy associated with the grocery store was I don't have that energy but that is real shit yeah it is I, I I mean I there are days that I walk in and I'm like just don't let there be an old lady with a checkbook and coupons <laughs> who needs a price check please for 50 cents <laughs> yeah. off bacon yeah. 50 cents off bacon I want it's my 50 a, cents yeah. here's so 50 whatever. cents whatever so I always find that energy or I always attract that energy and that's a whole nother subject is yeah. the attraction of energy but the, but the question asked is how do you fix it because it is everywhere so I just stopped going to the grocery store <laughs> we go to the grocery store well Not very like very rarely yeah. so up here what I wanted to say was that this is clean so right here where we are, there's there's no other humans other than our hosts that come out here. And and um, and so if they come out here and they feel they're having they're having a hard time, they transfer that energy to us. If we're having a hard time and they drive by, guess what? We give them we our give energy. them our energy. And if we're all in harmony, we're all in harmony, and, and then everything's we're all in and everything's fluid. Everything's working if out great. They're stressed or they're having experiences and we're stressed, then everything is not working out great. But but we've but got that figured out. That's what, as far as, four people? Yeah, four people. Now imagine a, a city. Imagine exactly. a, a, a- Where do you live? <laughs> Whoever's watching, where do you where live Where do you right live now? and how many, how many 
energy paths have crossed you. How many people are in your house right now? How many people are in your job? How many people you know, kids do you and... deal with on the highway? How many people are you coming back going, oh my God, I can't <laughs> believe this person today. Can you believe it? And it, you're transferring that energy all over many, to your spouse. How many Karens do you interact with? Oh my today? gosh. And I, <laughs> look, I am so anti the name Karen. Yeah, I call Kaya Karen. She calls our dog Karen. <laughs> she, so she she's is. putting that energy on my dog. I am on your dog on our dog well hey kaya yeah leave her alone but so that's you know, energy and to to summarize what we're talking about is you know from the time you turn on the tv in the morning to the time you turn the coffee pot on or you grab your first beer out of the refrigerator and right whenever here, guys. you know that to 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 hoping for for the outcome of the election or, or the outcome of a football game or whatever, they're just sucking the energy out of you. You are, you are literally just giving all your power away to these people unnecessarily because I'm sure your kids would love some of that enthusiasm that men put into the football games and in fishing and baseball games and, and into their cleaning their Harley Davidsons or, or polishing their cars the way they do. I'm, I'm sure the kids would love or the wife would love some of that energy that you put into their... Or maybe the husband would love some of the energy that the wife's putting in sitting there scrolling through Facebook all day long and not getting anything done and then the husband's been working all day and he's got to come home and get the kids ready for school and uh, well, the wife really hasn't done anything and she's putting all that energy onto him yeah. and maybe the, the 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 homeless person who is homeless because shit isn't right I right now your money yeah or, well yeah <laughs> but shit isn't right right now right. because the economy and this 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 covid thing that is going on right now maybe Maybe the energy that you put into your church and giving them money and giving them your time, maybe a family could could benefit, benefit from that, yeah. more from that energy that you're just giving away uh, or to the we're corporation. We're not suggesting going and giving money. What we're saying no, is it, we're just saying that that energy. But know, it, but it's hard to it's hard to my do, status in the church is up here because I've written my check every week. Yeah, but it's hard to discern the the the, the true energy, yeah, the absolutely. true love energy that 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 higher vibrating love of 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 helping out or becoming part of a community or becoming uh, uh, more more involved with your children, your wife or your family or or whoever whoever you claim to love or whatever you claim to love, maybe that energy that you put towards these 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 charity organizations and these foundations and this philanthropy and 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 uh, and, and protecting your president uh, candidate or your your politician candidate, uh, maybe that energy is better better served somewhere else. But you'll never know that when you're bombarded with with the distractions, the distractions the and negative energies yeah. of others. And, and the exploitation, being involved in the exploitation of others by buying products that were, were, were made using child labor or... or yeah, that's another thing we didn't talk know, about. Yeah. It's like, when you buy something, and I'm not suggesting don't go to the store and buy what you need, but when you buy something, that product that you take off the shelf, not only was it touched by 75 other people that day, but... Where did it come from? Who touched yeah, it? Yeah, the made marketing, that? the manipulation the of manipulation. the marketing. All that shit carries over to you. It does. You know, I made a video a while back about nobody's hands are clean. Uh, you should probably go back and watch, watch that it. because I talked about that. I talked about all the 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 influences that that have occurred and why these people are out there rioting and and killing each other and destroying everything and and this Energy. this shit matters and this shit doesn't matter and you don't matter and none of this matters man love is so fucked up and and at the low vibration of things and that, that's where division comes in because nobody can find balance nobody can find harmony everybody is is protecting their ego and right. and their perception in their their uh their program i just had a thought go ahead it's like nobody they're they're so fucked up down here with the love thing on the low vibration yeah and they're all that those of us who vibrate higher are like highlander it's like when you're around them it's oh you have this sound yeah, go it's, off it's and like, you're like what the hell 
oh wow they're like up here and you sense it and they're it's not this jump out and love and grab and like oh my god i love you you're yeah, high that... vibrating there's like this unknown respect for each other for, for, each for other. everything for everything around for you everything around that you. isn't man-made the natural there's things. no drama there's no drama in the high vibration no it's None. it's clean it's peaceful it is it's uh it's 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 relieving it, it it's like a load off your back it really is uh, and there's 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 no there's no comparison so people who 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 follow us and and have have supported us through our journey out here i mean i'm not the same person that came out here she can attest to that and she's not the same person no. that came out here uh, almost six months ago. I mean, we're coming up on our six month mark we are out here, and I am literally not the same person. No. I, I, my energy, my, my, my perception of the world has, has completely changed, changed. 180 degrees, not 360. <laughs> He did a whole 360. Yeah, my friend, he changed his whole life around. He did, he did a, 360. a 360. I was oh. like, oh, shit. So, so he's where he started. He started back. But anyway, so. Sorry. Anyway, there's just That's a funny. very low vibrating person there. The, so, <laughs> so no, out here after six months, half a year, it's been six months, guys. And half a year, we are not the same person. And we're now starting on this new spiritual self not just awareness but okay i i it's time to grow it's time to we're having discussions yeah, that we've never had like but we're not these weird fucking hippie wearing gowns and tie dye shit and getting involved in, in orgies and, and sex cults and shit like that you know that's that's a whole nother thing Whoa. separate from the christian christian i mean that's a that's what I call polarity, it's like, oh, there are no, so we love many our Bible and we love six wives over hippie here. Hippie guru sister, weirdos. Sister, what do they call them? Sister wives? Sister wives. Yeah. Oh <laughs> so, my gosh. You know, those, Look, those oh. fucking, we're not into that shit. No. We're not going to turn into tree huggers or we're not going to be, we are still authentic in who we are. Uh, we'll fuck you up if you if you cross us. Absolutely. Uh, that's just the way it is. I mean, there's there we're that's not. That's the way of the warrior. That is the way of our ancient people. They were not. Yes, they were peaceful. Our yeah, people they were, were peaceful. peaceful. Our tribal people, our ancestors. You know, and it's not just him because he's Native American. I am also tribal, and most of the people I know have tribal background of Celt or Scott or Native or. African. Hey guys, African. Yeah, draw from draw the energy from your, from ancients, your ancients, from your ancestors. Warriors from, defended themselves, but they got along in the tribe. They had to because Absolutely. it was harmony. It had to be harmony. Yes. That's where that peace comes in. Yes, the ant and the eagle both exist. We both exist. But if man comes across and tries to take our peace and our harmony, we can yeah it, it, they're gonna be they're gonna be dealt with accordingly boom, boom. you know and you know it's not like being out here there's not we're free of conflict there's there there definitely is there conflict is a lot out of here conflict out here people carry guns out here people As you heard. people hunt people trespass people don't give a shit and you know but they cut fences that you have to deal with that stuff and you do and uh you can't just be oh come on in we love you eat all our food and and kill us while we're sleeping fuck that no, no. you're not going to get that opportunity with us no uh because we are going to defend who we are and what we stand for right. and our integrity they are and we're defending our energy but it's the energy of our ancestors that yes. we draw off of the the unwritten laws of nature the unwritten laws yes. of the universe, not man-written laws, not man-made expectations. Do but, you still have to follow man-made laws? Yeah. I mean, just to coexist. To yes. coexist and to be peaceful. Yeah, I'm not going to slap somebody in line at a store because they're not you wearing a mask. To. But there are some people <laughs> who are slapping each other in the stores and attacking each other. Okay. We talked about energy. How does that even work? That's so How can low. that even work long term? How is that sustainable in any capacity? It's but, not. That's that's ignorance. The yelling, the aggression. But where are they different. drawing their energies from? They're drawing their energies from from TV and the media and, and influences. Ah, oh, that bitch come near me. I'm going to cut her and all this other shit. And it's like, nice. I don't even understand this. So we can think and those energies are still there but to <laughs> operate up here 
that takes a very special it's humorous i mean it's it's funny watching some oh. of this stuff not funny like ha ha that's 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 <laughs> hilarious that, that that dude just just smacked that chick for attacking him but it's funny that ironic that people don't get it they're buying into the the yeah. the 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 agendas they're buying into the the negativity that's being placed the upon them to, agendas, to yes. self destruct and 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 when you operate and I don't care who you are if you operate in a low vibration you will eventually self destruct if you never awaken you will self destruct mm -hmm. and there's just nothing you can do about that and understanding spirituality the way you we understand spirituality this being a, a soul trap Earth being a soul trap. It is destined, you know. People believe in, in heaven and hell. When your when your soul is 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 uh, kept at a low vibration, guess what? You're going towards the negative and not the positive. I don't care how many times you gave wrote a check to the church or how many sister wives you have, or how many you know charity uh, fundraisers you 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 uh, you attended or, or or contributed to where you vibrate when you die where your vibration was when you die is where your soul gets dispensed re returned to uh, and it's either going to be high vibrating or low vibrating right. and the church and the cults and all these other entities that claim to be helping people and becoming spiritual and soulful all answers are where within they're all they're, they're all, all right you are here. your own savior you know, and all answers are within and I, I think that if that's the message of anything with the energy you are in control you are absolutely 100 yes? percent. you would you wouldn't be alive i know people attest their 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 energy levels like i feel like dancing or i feel like doing a hundred push-ups or i don't feel like doing shit today as as their energy levels but that's the physical energy, energy. level you give that away too. I mean, as long as that's low, you're gonna have a hard time. Well, the emotional energy can drain you, just like it yeah. drains you at the grocery store. But it sucks the. I life can be having the you. worst day of my life, but if I know to go within and go, okay, uh, I'm glad to be out here. I'm gonna connect to the earth. I'm gonna connect to to nature. I'm gonna connect you come back up. to the highest vibration that I possibly can. I'm gonna meditate. I'm gonna pray a little bit. I'm gonna talk to my soul i'm going to have a conversation yes. with my soul and, and that's my, what prayer is yeah my soul prayer is your soul connecting your soul. to spirit and spirit is the greater collective consciousness is of, there of, an appropriate way to pray no 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 no, no. If prayer people can is... pray in hindu people can pray in chinese yes. people can pray in american or african or or Lebanese it or not, however the hell they want to pray that but we put on here we go with the soul here we go again with the the you're praying wrong or you're the wrong religion or you're not doing yeah, it right you, or you know there's not a right or wrong as long as your soul is connecting to spirit we're all going to the same we're, we're on the same journey the same source the same light the it just all the labels that people have put yeah on so all we can energy. talk about souls and Forever. energy and and uh <laughs> try to help as many people as we can wake up in these times because these times are kind of i don't know if you you kind of read the bible or if you uh they're shaky read, read any other prophecies that they're are coming shaky. i mean uh, how many more signs do you need <laughs> so i mean i i can say five years ago shit wasn't as bad as it is now but you know there's some pretty prophetic um uh, things coming to life right now and i would say things are drawing pretty 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 near to the the the, yeah. the 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 last book in the Bible, or or the the prophecies that other other uh, uh, nations or ancient nations yeah. left behind for us. There's a lot of people who don't who don't read the Bible. They they don't partake in that. I yeah. don't. I don't believe in it. I mean, it's a book. It's another book of stories. But your your ancestors spoke. Of, of Ragnarok, it prophecies. was right. There's prophecies in the Hopi prophecy. The Hopi prophecies, the the Christians, the yes. the Hindu, the, the Zuni. I, the, mean, I remember the, you talking about all, the Zuni. All these different tribes of ancient people were speak of the same thing. They knew one thing that they knew that this earth was was on cycles. It right. was it was a, a cyclical earth in the solar system and the stars and certain things happen every thirty six hundred years. And if you haven't 
read your Bible lately, you might want to understand that Noah, the time of Noah, was about 3,600 years ago, and we're coming, we're in that 3,600 year cyclical part of astrological events that are occurring and if you're not energy, to say we're predicting nope, there's no it's, I'm just, it's just I energy just, cycles that's just that's another part of my existence part of energy that that you know just being connected to spirit you you just know things and uh you you should energy be, cycles you should probably be, be preparing spiritually for what what what's coming Absolutely. ahead in the future so you should always be preparing spiritually but yeah it, now would be a good time to get right with that energy yeah so we're gonna leave it there um like subscribe uh hope you don't hate us too much for being honest hate as him, we can me. possibly be uh but <laughs> there's no integrity in 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 in, in candy coating a turd uh you know Whoa. there's there, there's just no way so we'll talk to you guys later yeah bye